like this video, and subscribe or Shrek will visit you tonight. Karen Halloween costume sparks backlash among shoppers. I'll keep observing Columbus Day. Thanks. What do you do to observe Columbus Day? Get lost in a grocery store looking for spices? Judge Karen likes locking up black kids to teach them about consequences, duck her in particular. An ancient Karen appears. Can you make a male babysitter pay child support? I'm a single mom going to college with my sister. We currently rent an apartment together. A couple weeks ago, I asked my neighbor, a trustworthy guy, if he could watch the kids for two hours while I went to class and my sister wasn't home. And he agreed. If he babysits and doesn't accept pay, can I sue him for child support because he took on a fatherly role? I'm sure I can convince a court that he accepted a fatherly role. What did she say? Karen. I want to speak to the manager of Bitcoin. Son. You manage your own Bitcoin mom. Karen. Karens. I don't like how they're profiting from the very real issue of recess. Road 1. Twitter user Helen Shivers. From the US. Has expressed her outrage. After spotting an outfit labeled Karen on the shelves of a local shop. Pictured. Dear Tyke Detergent. Are you out there? After watching your disgusting commercial with the white lesbian couple and their two black kids, I feel it's safe to say you just pushed me too far. See, I'm a white woman with white husband and white children. Your product doesn't represent me and my family so here's where we part ways. I'm sorry, but I feel a detergent should talk about what it does, what it costs, how it makes the clothes cleaner. I do not need to support a company who clearly cares so little about detergent and more about politics and the gene side of my race. Or did I take your meaning all wrong? Oh well. It's too late now I guess. That was the impression I got. Again. Thank you, but no thank you. Me and my families will deterge elsewhere. Be like the Mandalorian. Never take off your mask in public. This is the way Karen. Karen is a Star Wars character. Karen. The Demandalorian. Drunken swimming pool intruders who broke legs threaten legal action. A grandma and her friend who broke their legs after drunkenly breaking into a pool and going down the water slide and threatening legal action. Clavicus had been at the boozer for 4 hours on the 4th of August before heading to her pal Barry Dalgas house for some more beverages. But during the early hours, they decided to break into Aldershot Lido Leisure Park in Hampshire for an inebriated splashabout, but the decision to go down the water slide proved to be an extremely unwise one. Another hash Karen of the day did this bullshit accusing a 9 year old child of grabbing her ace. She actually said she was sensually assaulted when his backpack brushed her backside. The boy was crying because of this bullshit. If you lose this bag I'll need to see the manager. Local anti-vax Karen has reached peak Karen today. I think I have the gift of confrontation lol. Like when I see or hear people say stupid stuff I don't let it go far. I find the root and nap in the bud. They may hate me for it, but that gossip sure isn't going far. No fake allowed. Karen. Who never picked up after her dog. Gets reincarnated. Tell me you're bad at math without telling me you're bad at math. Karen. Have you ever been to a restaurant that does not give you the change when you pay with cash? My bill we $47.20. I gave the waitress $100. And she only gave me back $53. I called over the manager, which was our waitress. She said we don't usually carry change. I told her to give my $100 back and I'll pay with a credit card. 80 cents would not kill me, but it's the principle, if they do this to everyone that pays cash, over a year, that could be a lot of money in their pocket. I'd redo your math. Funny how most of you have no idea what Columbus did, or why we celebrate, but so quick to band it. Hey Judy. I have two history degrees, Bachelor of Arts and Master of Arts, in European history. Basically, I know everything about Columbus and would love to see your sources that show he is a good person. Please make sure they are from academic journals and that they are peer reviewed. Thanks. Happy Indigenous Peoples Day.
P.S. Duck Christopher Columbus. Because there are not enough drivers to transport participants to away games. Peoria Unified School District just up their base pay for bus drivers to $20 an hour. Other places like Target are making their base pay to $17 an hour during the holidays. There are more places looking to hire people than people who want to work so pay is going up in the retail sector and pulling workers from lower paying jobs. Unfortunately. I want to go on vacation to paradise, hum. At this point everywhere is hell, so this means heaven is the only place. Come soon Lord Jesus, seriously need a break like we all do, especially if you live in California. Low flying planes and harmful emissions. Is anyone else bothered by the low flying planes over? One woman posted that she finds orange stuff on her car when they do. I see no reason for this unsafe flying pattern over our residential area and have complained before. I plan to do it again. Please do it also, if you are bothered by it as I am. Have a happy Sunday. A Karen in the making is looking for roommates. I'm communicative and friendly, responsible and careful, love music, good films, sport and always ready to help. My budget is about $400 to $500 per month and I have nothing against sharing a room with someone. I wanna rent an apartment till the middle of July, and then if everything is okay to rent it again for the full semester. Something to note. 1. Neatness. 2. Being friendly. 3. I'm sorry, but I'm not LGBT friendly. If you are interested, or wanna offer a place to live in please DM me. Probably known from this sub, but there is a movie about a broom net Karen. Crazy entitled recess. I want the manager. Karen. Some Karens were protesting masks on the first day of school. There were only three at my school. Karens who dictate other people's lives be like. Innocent bystander. Minds her own business. Karen. I don't like your clothes. Take them off now. Innocent bystander. No. Karen. Now. You shall perish. If Karen was a dog. When you're mad because you have to wait for your large order you placed on the spot. At 4pm. The busiest hour in our area. Fast food and you wait 10 minutes on food. Taco Bell do better please. Don't beat anybody up. Lol. Frustrating. A woman was late for her flight. So she told airline workers there was a bomb on the plane. Police say. Doctor vs Karen. Terrifying monster scream. It's just a mask Karen. Don't talk about constitutional rights. I shouted at 14 minimum wage teenagers today. I leave my kids unvaccinated because of overpopulation. Amateurs. What was that? Punk. Amateurs. Don't call me a Karen. I couldn't make store up, even if I wanted to. Karens. Karen presented her research to the class. This is the aftermath. This girl from my high school has never left our hometown. She removes her kids from public school because of masks and also complains about online schooling during the pandemic. She doesn't stop. If you don't mind me asking why, are you homeschooling? I did homeschooling last year for my babies with this pandemic shut, but they just struggled but. It was online with the teachers I think. If I did it with them without the teacher they would have been fine. I will never do online again lol. Online was really annoying. We are doing homeschooling because of the mask issue first off. Then the things they are being taught and influenced by. We just don't really like that. It just really fits better with our family and lifestyle. A real Karen doing Karen things. People who are vaccinated can get it and spread it. These upcoming vaccine mandates are outrageous. My body my choice. All the way around. Karen's making ads these days. Become a Daily Wire member today and help us defeat this unconstitutional vaccine mandate. Use code do not comply at checkout to save 25% off. Hash do not comply. Hum nope. I'll starve. Karen's. Country kitchen. Karen cares about human rights today. Inhumane. 
but it's okay to invite people to cross in the middle of nowhere and possibly die in the desert? Inhumane to allow people to fall off the wall and die. Inhumane to allow them to live under a bridge in filth. First day on the job and Guys, I think my harpy lady is a Karen. Abshin is a failure for every woman and her unborn child. A failure of love, justice and mercy. Karen Swallow Pryor writes in a guest essay. Texas New Abshin law is far from perfect, but I hope it can move us closer to these ideals. Opinion. Texas Abshin law should force America to change its ways. Karen Swallow Pryor. To all the Karens out there. Duck you. Karen attempting salt. Cops. Taser.